Cage questionnaire is a psychological tool which is aimed at assessing if the person has any potential alcohol problems. Okay. Potential. Okay, we are not actually going in depth, we are only looking at if there is any potential problems that need to be further investigated into. Okay. So it's the cage criteria cage questionnaire or the cage system as it's called has four questions okay the cage itself is an acronym so you have c a g and e c stands for cut down which means you're supposed to ask if the person has ever tried to cut down his alcohol usage okay that's the first question has he ever tried to cut down second is anger has he ever felt angry when others criticize him regarding his drinking problem? The second question. G stands for guilty. Does the person feel guilty regarding his drinking? And E stands for eye opener. Which means does he need a drink every time he wakes up in the morning to continue on with his regular life? So these four questions are asked and if you get a minimum of two yes the problem should be investigated further to rule out serious alcohol dependency okay now the advantages of this is it's reliable okay what does reliability mean it means if the same question is asked to the same person it remains the same so the results are reproducible yes and it's also valid now what is validity it measures what it's supposed to measure measures what needs to be measured now what are we trying to measure here we are trying to measure if the person has any alcohol problems and these questions are directed towards that particular thing itself and it's, it's reliable as well as valid and one more thing is it's quick asking the four questions and getting an answer takes less than a minute Okay, now this questionnaire can only be used for alcohol abuse and not for any other substance abuse like cannabis or cocaine or nicotine etc. For that modified versions of the cage system can be used but then again their reliability and validity have not been thoroughly tested. Yes, now there are a few limitations for this system. One of the limitations is the stigma okay the questions are apparent when you ask the question the person will know that you are asking the questions aimed at his alcoholic problems now if there is a social stigma attached with alcoholism in his given community or his environment he will not be willing to give you the correct answers yes so one of the thing is stigma and the second thing is malingering the person might lie about his condition to prevent further intervention. Okay, we have that. So after this, there have been certain modifications which you'll be needing to know in case you are asked about this. So few other modifications are tweak, okay, mast and audit. Now, tweak is a five question okay five question modification of cage only and it aims at risk of alcoholism in pregnancy okay that's tweak mast stands for michigan alcoholism screening test okay alcoholism screening test and it's a total of a 25 question test which aims at lifetime symptoms okay with more focus on the recent symptoms but it takes into consideration the lifetime and has 25 questions important by your entrance point of view and there is a briefer version called brief mast which has only 10 questions yes and then we have the audit which also has 10 questions and it stands for alcohol use disorder identification test okay 
so with this we complete cage criteria hope you enjoyed the video see you in my next one thank you guys